Let's move on. Sharad Pawar faction leader Rohit Pawar is all set to appear before the enforcement directorate in connection with the alleged Maharashtra State Cooperative Bank scam. Ahead of his questioning, security has been tightened outside Rohit Pawar's residence. NCP staged protest. Sharad Pawar and Supriya Sule are accompanying Rohit Pawar at ED office in Mumbai. The Pawar faction leader said he will cooperate fully with the authorities. But looking at the current politics of revenge, there is a lot of pressure from the government on all the institutions. Meanwhile, a massive show of strength is being planned by NCP Sharad Pawar faction. Party workers from across Maharashtra will come to support Rohit Pawar in Mumbai. Sharad Pawar and Supriya Sule have also reached NCP headquarters. We're joined by Shweta on this. Shweta Rohit Pawar to appear before enforcement directed in connection with this money laundering case. As far as Maharashtra Cooperative Bank case is concerned, what can be expected? We believe there is a show of strength, a demonstration by NCP leaders and workers. That's correct. In fact, let me quickly show you the visuals what we are uh, giving to our viewers from the NCP headquarters. My video journalist Sahil is showing you the visuals of the NCP supporters being gathered large in numbers with the Gandhi Topi written, Me Rohit Pawar. That is, I am Rohit Pawar. You can see any of the Topi that has been mentioned and here huge crowd has already gathered in support i will also quickly show you the banners and the placards they have been holding and in the recent tweet also rohit pawar mentioned that he will be appearing before the agency and he will be accompanied by supriya sule and ncp supremo sharad pawar uh, this is important to note that when we talk about a maharashtra state cooperative bank loan scam case now remember 70 thousand loan scam case has many names and a few names have already uh, emerged in last four months where we see Project Tanpure, Prasad Tanpure, uh, Prasad Deshmukh. These are some of the names in additional charge sheet. These names are already there. But NCP faction of Sharad Pawar are asking one question that why only Rohit Pawar's name is there? There were many leaders whose names are already there in the case but they are not being summoned. Reason being they have been using uh, uh, technically what they have been uh, mentioning that they are in the ruling government now with Ajit Pawar faction. I will quickly show you the other side also Radhika. Here we see that in large in numbers the protesters, the in fact supporters of NCP have gathered and in some time we see that even Rohit Pawar will be reaching here and after this uh, a long march pass will be taking place. However, police barricading has been already done ahead of this lane where ED, uh, ED uh, office is situated but but ahead of that, we see that police barricading and police deployment has already kept in place by the Mumbai police. All right. Thank you, Shweta. We'll keep coming back to NCP supporters uh, gathering in large numbers outside uh, the ED office uh, where Rohit Pawar will be questioned in just a bit. आपसे जाना चाहेंगे कि ये जिस तरीके से ईडी ने समन किया है, इसे लोग पॉलिटिकल वेंडेटा कह रहे हैं, क्या कहना चाहेंगे? देखिए पॉलिटिकल वेंडेटा ही है। हमारे रोहित दादा ने जब भी कोई भी सेंट्रल एजेंसी ईडी ने जो मांग की, वो दस्तावेज सब साधर किया, सब कुछ दिया। फिर भी उनको प्रेशर करा � वो हमारे हमारे ऑपोजिशन के खिलाफ बात करें बीजेपी के खिलाफ बात करें तो उनके प्रेशर दबाव डाला जा रहा है लेकिन इसके साथ ही जब महाराष्ट्र स्टेट कॉपरेटिव बैंक के लोन स्कैम की बात कर रहे हैं रोहित पवार के अलावा भी कई लोगों के नाम शामिल हैं जिसमें ऐसे लोग जो शामिल हैं जो इस वक्त शरद पवार के गुट में नहीं है मेरा यही सवाल है सत्तर हजार करोड़ सत्तर हजार करोड़ कर करके इलेक्शन जीते उन्होंने आज वही सत्तर हजार करोड़ उनके घर में बैठे हैं उनके ऊपर कब सवाल करोगे आप हमारा सवाल यही है अगर न्याय करना है तो सबके साथ न्याय करिए सवाल उठाना है तो सब पे सवाल उठे अगर आप प्रेशर डालना चाहते रोहित दादा पे तो आपको बताता हूँ यहाँ जितने भी है ना सब रोहित दादा है कोई डरता नहीं है All right, so uh, Rohit Pawar all set to appear before the Enforcement Directorate. In fact, uh, Sharad Pawar as well as Supriya Sule have already 
arrived at Enforcement Directorate Office in Mumbai, where Rohit Pawar will be joining very soon. In fact, uh, this is in connection with the alleged Maharashtra State Cooperative Bank scam. As you can see on your screens, uh, heavy deployment there. Of course, NCP supporters, uh, NCP workers uh, are, in fact, outside. That Investigation against you See, I don't know about that, but wherever possible, I'm going to cooperate. Till today, I've cooperated, and now also I have to go to the ED office. Uh, till then, you know, I've come, and uh, I want to take darshan of Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj and Vidhan Bhavan also, because Vidhan Bhavan is a representation of uh, constitution. Serious it's allegations of corruption in the Baramati Agro. Serious see, 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 there are no serious allegations. Uh, I don't want to do a media trial. Uh, when I come outside the office after uh, talking to all the officers, then I'll specifically tell you what the case is. Political vendetta, you think? I won't comment now. <laughs> Action from uh, Rohit Pawar there. In fact, he says uh, he will uh, make a statement uh, after uh, the questioning is uh, concluded for the day. In fact, Rohit Pawar there also to appear before the Enforcement Directorate. Uh, this is in connection to Maharashtra State Cooperative Bank scam. Of course, uh, when asked whether this is political vendetta, he says he will comment on it later and that the allegations are not serious. आपसे जाना चाहेंगे कि ये जिस तरीके से ईडी ने समन किया है, इसे लोग पॉलिटिकल वेंडेटा कह रहे हैं, क्या कहना चाहेंगे? देखिए पॉलिटिकल वेंडेटा ही है। हमारे रोहित दादा ने जब भी कोई भी सेंट्रल एजेंसी ईडी ने जो मांग की, वो दस्तावेज सब साधन किया, सब कुछ दिया। फिर भी उनको प्रेशर करा � वो हमारे हमारे ऑपोजिशन के खिलाफ बात करें बीजेपी के खिलाफ बात करें तो उनपे प्रेशर दबाव डाला जा रहा है लेकिन इसके साथ ही जब महाराष्ट्र से एक कॉपरेटिव बैंक के लोन्स कैम की बात कर रहे हैं रोहित पवार के अलावा भी कई लोगों के नाम शामिल हैं जिसमें ऐसे लोग जो शामिल हैं जो इस वक्त शरद उनके ऊपर कब सवाल करोगे? हमारा सवाल यही है। अगर न्याय करना है, तो सबके साथ न्याय करिए। सवाल उठाना है, तो सब पे सवाल उठे। अगर आप प्रेशर डालना चाहते हैं रोहित दादा पे, तो आपको बताता हूँ। यहाँ जितने भी हैं ना, सब रोहित दादा हैं। कोई डरता नहीं है। All right, so uh, Rohit Pawar all set to appear before the Enforcement Directorate. In fact, uh, Sharad Pawar as well as Supriya Sule have already arrived at uh, Enforcement Directorate office in uh, Mumbai where Rohit Pawar will be joining very soon. In fact, uh, this is in connection with the alleged Maharashtra State Cooperative Bank scam. As you can see on your screens, uh, heavy deployment there. Of course, NCP supporters, uh, NCP workers... Uh, are in fact outside that, ED office. Investigation against you now. How do you See, know? I don't know about that, but wherever possible, I'm going to cooperate. Till today, I've cooperated, and now also I have to go to the ED office. Uh, till then, you know, I've come, and uh, I want to take darshan of Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj and Vidhan Bhavan also, because Vidhan Bhavan is a representation of uh, constitution. Serious it's allegations of corruption in uh, the Baramati Agro. Serious see, 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 there are no serious allegations. Uh, I don't want to do a media trial. Uh, when I come outside the office after uh, talking to all the officers, then I'll specifically tell you what the case is. Political vendetta, you think? I won't comment now. <laughs> Action from uh, Rohit Pawar there. In fact, he says uh, he will uh, make a statement uh, after uh, the questioning is uh, 
concluded for the day. In fact, Rohit Pawar there also to appear before the Enforcement Directorate. Uh, this is in connection to Maharashtra State Cooperative Bank scam, of course. Uh, when asked whether this is political vendetta, he says he will comment on it later and that the allegations are not serious.